Beginning with motorcycles, and we have good news. Honda Two Wheelers India has confirmed that the CB300R will be launched in India this year. Honda has said that the new Neo Sports Cafe Racer will be priced below 2.5 lakh and bookings have been opened at Rs 5,000. The new motorcycle will come powered by a 286cc liquid-cooled single-cylinder engine which puts out 31 brake horsepower and 28 Nm of torque. The new Kawasaki ZX-6R has been launched in India at an introductory price tag of Rs 10.49 lakh ex showroom. The new Ninja ZX-6R essentially competes with the likes of Triumph Daytona 765 which is yet to launch in India and the older 675 is out of production. Now this makes the ZX-6R the only middleweight supersport in the country. It is powered by a 636cc liquid-cooled inline four-cylinder engine which puts out 128 brick horsepower. Now news from Dakar Rally 2019, the Stage 9 finished yesterday with some spectacular news coming from the two Indian teams, the Sherco TVS and Speedbrain Hero Motorsport. Sherco TVS's Michael Medgay finished ahead of everyone else in the Stage 9 of the rally yesterday. He is, however, currently at 22nd position overall. On the other hand, Hero's Oriol Mina has some great news for his team. As he's finished an overall standing of 9th position, he has breached into the top 10 of the rally. Unfortunately, the rally has already claimed two of very promising riders from Indian teams, with CS Santosh and Lorenzo Santolini already out of contention. And finally, KP Arvind seems to have consolidated his run, making it to the 39th position overall. The new 2019 Hyundai Creta's launch date and prices have been revealed. Sources close to the development have told us that the Creta will be priced at Rs 9.6 lakh for the base variant and the launch will happen in the first week of February. The Jeep Compass lineup has been added with a new variant, Longitude O, which is a petrol 80, at a price of Rs 18.9 lakh ex showroom. With this new variant, the Compass Petrol is available in all four trims, which are the Sport, Longitude O, Limited and Limited Plus. Jeep India will also be launching the range-topping Compass Trail Hawk later this year. Speaking of variants, the Honda City lineup has been updated with a new one, the ZX Petrol Empty, and two new color options are available as well. The new ZX variant is priced at Rs 12.75 lakh ex showroom. Honda Cars India have updated the entire city lineup with rear parking sensors as standard fitment. Skoda India has launched the 2019 Superb Corporate Edition in India at a starting price tag of Rs 23.99 lakh ex showroom. The Corporate Edition will be available in two color options, however, this car will only be available to existing Skoda customers. Skoda has also said that a new automatic variant will be launched later this year.